How does the brain react to suspense? So what do filmmakers do to generate tension and how do our brains respond to that? The brain is in, to a significant degree, a prediction machine. Um, your brain's always trying to figure out what's coming down the pike. And just being able to do that on the time scale of a fraction of a second or a few seconds is hugely helpful, right? So if there's an object moving quickly in your general direction, being able to predict the exact trajectory, it's going to tell you whether you got a duck or not. If you're starting to talk about your friend's surprise party and you see them getting close enough that they might hear, being able to predict what they're going to be able to hear in a couple seconds is important for avoiding that social faux pas. And Hitchcock wrote awesome things about surprise and suspense and how they work in film. You know, suspense uh, is often a situation where there's uh, a couple potential outcomes in play and you don't know how it's going to unfold. But there's also situations where you have a piece of information that the characters don't have. And so the ambiguity is not like about whether there's a bomb in the trunk that's going to go off, but about how the characters are going to figure out that there's a bomb in the trunk and whether they're going to uh, avoid getting blown up when it goes off. Um, and so that's all stimulating that, that prediction system, confronting it with situations where there's entropy is maximal, where you're like super uncertain about what's going on on dimensions that your brain is invested. 